In the fourth day of the sentencing phase for Cedric Marks, he told the jury he is responsible for the deaths of Jenna Scott and Michael Swearingen. This comes after a jury found Marks guilty of capital murder. The state is now seeking the death penalty. Six News reporter Sydney Deshawn was in the courtroom and tells us how Marks told the jury he is ready for the death penalty. Sydney, what a development today. Yeah, Chris, while Marks continued to testify on his own behalf today, he cried to the jury and said, quote, you should give me the hardest punishment, end quote. He also says he should have told the truth in the first place and that he is ready to go. Marks admitted to choking Scott and threatening Swearingen, which he previously denied. Marks told the jury, quote, I have been a liar. I feel that I am absolutely responsible for the death of Jenna Scott and Michael Swearingen, end quote. But he later went back on his word, saying his ex-girlfriend Maya Maxwell killed Scott and broke her ribs and that a stranger killed Swearingen. He says he was just there to clean up the mess. When prosecutors got the chance to cross-examine Marks, they asked him if he was the one who dug the hole and drug the bodies in the grave. Marks said yes. Marks then testified he filled the grave, but said he is not a murderer. Belled County District Attorney Henry Garza says Marks is trying to control this narrative. Marks in response said, quote, no, I just really hate you, end quote. Now Marks is calling as in his final witness tomorrow. Closing arguments should take place right after. Six News will be there with the latest coverage. Yeah, maybe we'll have a decision by tomorrow afternoon. Thank you so much, Sydney Deshaun. You've been in the courtroom for most of this trial.